So my daughter, she got bit by a dog today. Yeah, look at the anti-abortion demonstrators. The posters had cut up babies. Another day. Ooh, I just walked home. I love you. You're such a good boy. He's such a good boy. Look, Oreo. What are you? Are you a good? <laughs> okay, I think she's. You're a, you're a good boy. I love you so much. You're the best baby boy ever. I love you. <laughs> okay. I'm getting a COVID test from him again. <laughs> Bless you. Did you sneeze because you have allergies? He has <laughs> I love you too. <laughs> oh, you're so silly. I love, I love you so much, Oreo. Bless you. Boop. <laughs> Bless you. I love you. I love you so much. You're the best. You're the best little boy, and I love you so much. You're such a good boy. I did not video a lot on my birthday because I wanted to be in the moment. My birthday was on Thursday and on Wednesday night. I got a few friends together and... And we had sort of a movie night. So, um, I'm having a movie night with some friends. Yo, Alex! Oh my god, Alex! Girl! Oh my god. Yo, so Jay. <laughs> Yo, Juliana. <laughs> you should start a vlog, Eliza. Crazy. What the hell? <laughs> I can't with those glasses. <laughs> okay. What day is it? Um, uh, Wednesday. Date. Okay, make it. And then. Hey. What day is two days hey, from hey, now? Is this, is this Friday, Friday. Friday. Sorry, this is one of those control. <laughs> your camera's so bad. I'm just what? zooming in and out of your phone. Hey, look. We are watching Too Hot to Handle now. Yeah. This is literally my imitation of like every girl. Like, this is my imitation of a girl. Hello. My name is like Abigail. I'm 18 years old. And um, I'm British. And I'm super hot, as you can see, yeah. And also, I cannot wait for an old man to, like, take advantage of me. I everyone left us! <laughs> You're so loud. I said everybody ditched us. Well, they ditched us because they have to go home. Mm. It's also because it's late and it's a school day. Fuck school. <laughs> I'm with Oreo. Speaking of Oreo, I saw a dog... Okay, so... I started off my birthday weekend, not weekend, my birthday day. I started it off with going to senior signing day. Hi. Oreo's being super cute. Um, basically senior signing day is just, I don't even know what it is. It was just to like get your picture taken and stuff. So I went to get my picture taken, but before that I saw a dog, a dog, that reminded me so much of Oreo. He looked like he was a Shih Tzu. His name was Tico. So I wanted to pet him. So I asked the woman. I, well, I was telling her about the dog. She was like really friendly. I was telling her about Oreo. And I showed her a picture of Oreo. And I asked if I could pet her dog. And she said her dog wasn't really that friendly. So I said, okay. But she let her dog approach me. Um, so I guess when the dog was approaching me, I held out my hand so that he could sniff me, but instead of sniffing me, he bit me. <laughs> this is the bite. Ah! Also bit me just a bit. Um, so my daughter, who is almost 18, she got bit by a dog today, and it's a very minor- dog? Yeah, it's a very minor bite. I'm trying to figure out if we need to do anything, and I, it was on her finger, and it broke skin, but it's a graze. It was like, like the type of thing you would put triple ointment on. Um, 
I still have my, what do you call this? Lay. It's called a lay. I still have my lay on, but basically the doctor said I'm fine. I don't even need antibiotics. It wasn't that big of a deal. And so now I'm just icing it because it feels good. <laughs> so yeah, that's what happened. I got bit by a dog for the first time. Woo, woo. Today I'm vlogging my birthday. You want to say hi? Oh, no. Sure. Hello. This is Vlog. Heidi. <laughs> and I'm in my English class right now. <laughs> but we're not learning anything. I got some more friends together and I said, let's go to the mall. So we went to the mall. And at the mall, that's when a lot of things started to happen. Ha! <laughs> I am at the mall in pizza. My friend Eliza is protecting me from a guy who's hitting on me. <laughs> Thank you, Eliza. No problem. She's my girlfriend for the day. <laughs> for the two days. Two <laughs> days. Oh my god. That guy said I have... Oh my god. He, he said I had nice teeth. He was being creepy, okay? Creep. He's like, damn. <laughs> Probably got turned on by my cheek. So now we have, we have. Happy birthday. Thank you. We have food. <laughs> Lemonade and, uh, I keep calling them bagel bites. Uh, a pretzel bag bites. of, oh, pretzel bites. That's I almost said, bite. never mind. Bagel bites. Bagel. They're really buttery. Buttery. And salty. <laughs> this is a fun birthday, to be honest. It's yeah. also your 18th birthday. <laughs> Part of the perks of living in Maryland is that there's a lot of different people in Maryland. You'll see skaters. You'll see. You'll see the whole rainbow spectrum. You'll see. Um, who else do you see? Who do you see in Maryland? Anyone. Anyone. Lots of people here. Who else is there? Um. There's cute guys walking down the street. <laughs> <laughs> What's I gonna say? Oh yeah, there's a lot of, um, lots of cities in Maryland too. Lots of them. <laughs> <laughs> there was this, there's this like, the mall that we went to. This is really good by the way. There was this big area where you can gather and like eat and like a lot of people were skating there and everything. Lots of skater people. Off I go! <laughs> skater boys! I told you about them. They were actually videoing. People come there to play music, to preach, to pick it. So there are people playing music and there's this trumpet guy. And because I was wearing like a visible birthday crown and a birthday sash, this trumpet guy started playing happy birthday on his trumpet. I didn't realize, <laughs> at first I didn't realize that he was playing happy birthday and it was for me. So a few of my friends realized, and they literally, it was hilarious, they were awkwardly just like, they were like, Abigail, like, and, and so everybody was looking at me. And I'm like, why is everybody looking at me? And I'm like, oh, oh, this guy's playing happy birthday for me. That's so sweet. It was really funny <laughs> because everybody in the whole area was looking at me. I'm just like, <laughs> they all wish me happy birthday, which was really, really nice. It's the kind of place where random people who you don't even know wish me happy birthday. Happy birthday. Because they saw that I was wearing my birthday stuff and that's really nice. You know, it's that kind of friendly place. We hung out for a bit. We went into stores. There are a few crazy things because it's like, it is a busy area. So sometimes crazy things go down. There was a guy who tried to come into the mall without a mask. I guess he was like anti-mask, which like, fine, you do your thing. But if there's a rule that you have to wear a mask, like, be expected to be kicked out of a place where it says you have to wear a mask, you know? And he literally had a surprise Pikachu face when he was told that he had to leave or put on a mask. He was like... Me? Look at my tongue. Last but not least, we got the anti-abortionist. 
people. Yeah, look at the anti-abortion demonstrators. Like, what the hell? Nobody wants you there. Look, I respect all people's views. Personally, though, that's the whole reason I'm pro-choice because we don't we don't want your views on display. Just like we don't shove our poor pro-choice views in your face. It's one thing if you like feel that abortion is murder and like are against it, but you're not shoving that in people's faces. Sorry, I'm, it's a rant. It's a freaking rant. <laughs> Nobody wants these 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 weird people here. Nobody wants to see these pictures. Does anybody even care? Yeah, we care about women's bodies. They came to that main area and they had these graphic posters like, of like bloody cut up babies. Kids were there and it was really disturbing. So there's the abortion people and then there are triggered teenagers talking to them, which I'm really thankful for them. I'm really thankful for that because I probably would have done it if it weren't for them. I'm really, let's check them, let's check it out. I like how these teenagers are standing up for what they believe in. And I like how, I like how they're debating. I like how they're debating. I'm really, I think I might like thank them or something. Praise Ella. Honestly, I'm so thankful for these teenagers. Which bag is yours? Honestly, thank God. So, what just happened was there. Oh, Dougie. Aw. Sorry. There are these crazy women who were protesting abortion. Women and men. And men. And uh, they were crazy. They showed. And the posters had cut up babies in it, and they're like, Do you even care about me? As the baby's saying it, and I thought it was so stupid because, well, like. It's a girl's body. Yeah, exactly. That kid just stared at me like <laughs> somebody haunted fucking us. garbage. Oop. And I don't know. It's just it really upset me, and I wanted so badly to muster up the courage to go over there and talk to them. And it's one thing if they believe that they don't like abortion. I mean, I do believe in freedom of choice and stuff, but it's one thing that they believe. I don't know. I guess if you have your beliefs, if you want abortion to be legal. But it's another if they're having these triggering posters of, of cut up bloody babies um, on a poster and then the, they're protesting it outside where everyone can see. Even little kids. Yeah, it's kind of sad. It's really messed up. So, um, yeah, I really wanted to go and talk to them, but luckily these... Uh, I held their back. <laughs> these... Uh, uh, teenagers who actually, uh, I think they go to Blair. They go to her school. I think one of them actually goes to my school. Probably seen her around some. Uh, the one with the pink hair did. Yeah, the one with the pink hair goes to my school. Um, they were literally, they beat me to it. They were literally, you know, told those protesters right up how it was people's choice and that they shouldn't get involved. And I just thank them so much. Because if you protest this stuff in a place like this, you're going yeah. to get... In trouble. In trouble. So, you know, that was really fun. To, like, I was celebrating my birthday and then I had to see those images. When I was walking to catch my ride. That was really, really the icing on the cake. <laughs> on the birthday cake. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. Oreo likes the balloon. <sighs> Alright. Today is the next day, and I still can't believe I'm 18. Honestly, I feel like I'm six. Um, I sorry I really look like shit right now. Uh because I got my second dose of the vaccination and I'm tired and I think that's sort of part of the side effect so I like slept the whole day but it also could be because <sighs> I slept a lot last night too even before I got my second dose because everything, the whole party or like everything that we did, 
I was just so exhausted from. Because basically I'll just show you like what I got. Um, my friend, hold on, my friend got me this cute balloon. She got me this cute balloon. It's really good quality too, it feels like a beach ball. It says happy birthday, it's got rainbows and unicorns on it. And then I got this shirt. I really liked it. My mom isn't too happy about it, but I like that style, so my mom says it's too skimpy. She rolls her eyes at my fashion choice. I got these fake eyelashes because I needed more of them. I got candy, baby bottle. I got Laffy Taffy too, which I already ate this morning. And then I got Doritos, which I also already ate. Um, when I went to uh, I went to the pizza place last night to get like myself pizza as like a snack and They saw it was my birthday. So they gave me this free cake. It's called mod no-name cake and I haven't tried it yet, but it looks like it's like chocolate it's So cute. It's chocolate And it really smells good. It smells like one of those like donuts that are coated in chocolate I got a crown for my parents to wear it says like it's my wrong way it's my 18th birthday so i wore the crown for the day it was really fun and then i also got a sash that says happy birthday on it happy birthday i'm gonna do the same thing for my 21st birthday because 18 and 21 are big deals so if i still have this Oh my god, I am just so tired. <laughs> From senior signing day, I got this lay. And one more thing. I'm obsessed with jewelry, so I got this since I'm a Taurus, because I was born May 6th, that makes you a Taurus. I got this Taurus with like, it says Taurus and it has a constellation on it. And my friend Eliza also happens to be a Taurus, so we actually got matching necklaces and we wore them around the mall. So that was really fun. <laughs> it's funny because Eliza's the only one who likes selfies and who likes to take videos with me as much as I do. Cake. It's actually amazing. It's amazing. It's got frosting in the middle and it's just a cake and it's really, really good. <laughs> 